Hello and welcome to Aporia Beyond the Valley, a game released in 2017 by something north, I forgot. I put it off the screen, I can't read it now. Is it on the screen somewhere here? No, it's not. Um, investigate North? I want to say Investigate North is the developer. Uh, from Denmark, I believe, Copenhagen. And um, that's all I know. That's not all I know. It's a first person puzzler. <laughs> it's CryEngine? And I think that's all I know. So let's just click the button and see what happens. If you get lost, press M to view the map. That seems like a good tip. I don't know. I bought this on sale uh, in July or something. <laughs> Something's popping in. But it's still a nice scene. Looks good. I don't know if we're expecting a lot of plot here. A lot of backstory, this seems kind of laggy. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, I like it. Is that me? Did I just wake up? WASD space to jump, I guess. That's what that's supposed to mean. Yep. Oh, that feels weird. That feels like a very weird jump. I don't know why, though. I think you stay at the top of the jump a little bit too long for it to feel like normal. <laughs> but we'll get used to that. Okay, what are we doing here? Oh, okay. If there were more people, this this person got crushed, probably. No one in here. No one in here. Nothing at all in here. Okay. Sure. This seems broken too. Not good, not good. Okay, you want me to go that way? Let's see. There are different symbols, different... So this person... Had a, an, or an oar, they were rowing. <laughs> I, I control the sun, obviously. <laughs> uh, this person had a stack of books, or maybe bricks. <laughs> Um, plant person, yes, yes, yes. Bow and arrow person, good. Use for, this guy can read. Yes, also use for skill. <laughs> what are we doing here? We don't know. So all of us have one of these weird sticks. Glow sticks, the one that we just picked up. And if you bring all of them to the left and to the right of the city, then <laughs> something happens. I don't know. I don't... I don't know. What happened to everyone else, though? Why was I still asleep? Okay, put my glow stick in here. Okay. What are you doing? You're... you're putting stuff in here. And you fill it into the glow stick. So bird, bird face made the glow stick and then gave it to red robe. And red robe took it. And then? Did what? Thanked Birdface, and then? Everyone had one. That's me. 
There's brick person, plant person, bow and arrow person. Was this one maybe? <laughs> all right, and they all went in here. Who made this guy the leader though? Explaining how the glow stick works, yes. Put it on the pedestal and then the door opens. Okay, so that's what I'm doing next, I guess. I wonder if it's worth it to go exploring here. We can sprint, I do like that. Probably isn't worth it to go exploring. <laughs> but like there is this, you know, there's the potential for stuff to be back here. At very at the very least. And I you know, it's a new game, I'm not familiar yet, so I think I need to do a little bit of exploring just to do my due diligence to figure out if there might be secrets. It doesn't really look that way though. Lens Freya. <laughs> what happened out here? Like, why did we get locked in the cave? With our girl sticks. I wonder. I do like the very minimalistic storytelling though. So far, at least. It's kind of hard to to balance that with being, like, informative enough to tell the story, actually. But so far, I mean, can't complain, I guess. Yeah, take the potion. I don't know what that does. I mean, you have the meter there on the bottom right. I don't know what that does, though. Are we just, like, refueling our glow stick? Possibly. Before we go downstairs, we need to check here. Okay. too we do can I drop in here I can was I supposed to drop in here I was supposed to move this stuff out of the way so we're, we're, we're not stuck in here <laughs> that's my, my worry initially um are just refueling with that. It's like a lantern. <laughs> kind of. Okay. Music is swelling up, but it's okay. I kind of like throwing around these rocks. 
Wish I could throw these ones too, but I can't. Almost four, or basically four. I don't know. That's good, I guess. Music's getting quiet now. Can I take more than I need? No. Well, I don't know. That seems like it just disappeared there. Oh yeah, I do know that I can crouch. Okay. Well, go left. Doesn't do anything. Go right. Doesn't do anything. Interesting. Feels like you should be doing something. Where's this line go? It goes here. Okay, we need to turn it on here first. And then we have the line in there, and in there we can reroute it to the left. Okay. I understand. I understand. And then we get the hammer. The hammer symbol sinks into the ground and opens up the basement. Very good. Not really a basement, just the way you go. Uh, we could just keep going, but I guess let's look around more. Keep stumbling into the way to go without even trying to. I haven't even seen these bars yet. Nice. Some more juice for our glow stick. Right, I know we can't go this way. We actually have to go. We have to go downstairs. Okay. Fair enough. Will this make a decent screenshot? Let's say yes and take one. Now, if you hadn't picked that one up yet, we could fill our glow stick all the way up. That's okay. For now, at least. I mean, I don't know. It would be weird. Uh, yeah, as a mechanic, it doesn't really make sense to ever have us run out of the, the fuel. <laughs> Unless there's like a checkpoint system in place for that, I don't know. I think it's just going to be you explore and you find the the potions, the fuel, and then there's always going to be enough around each of the like puzzle things, so you can't get stuck. Would be my guess. But you have to explore in order to find them to get them to be able to actually solve the puzzles, which I don't really know how the puzzles are going to work so far. Which is like. You know, putting the stick in and then moving it. It's not, it's not very hard, <laughs> but I'm sure that's going to change. Shift. I oh, know I can sprint, but why, why do you want me to sprint here? It's going to fall apart. It's going to crush me. And for now, it's good. Oh, because it's a timed thing, maybe? I'll pour it down. Doesn't work. Oh, we have to go right, because there's the light. Maybe? No. We need to turn this on first. No, we need to turn this on first. And then we can go the other way. Okay. And this one goes... Down there, okay. Well, it's a fall damage? Yes. Kind of. I didn't mean to fall, I was just, I jumped up top and then I kept slipping. Anyway. Are we four? No. We 
Might have been one here too. Interesting. It's not time. Okay. What happened? What happened here? Hmm. Can I have some gold? No. A hammer? No. Do we go back up here? Or do we go down? Do we go all the way up? Uh, I don't know. Let me see where I am. Because <laughs> like holding the, the rope and pouring makes me look that way. Weird. Does this take fuel? I don't think it does, right? It just fuels infinitely. It's just gonna make the video look better. <laughs> okay, so there's just fuel in this from maybe? Maybe there's more. Let's see if there's more than fuel. There is more collapsed stuff. What else do we have? I don't know. The other side of that bridge? Maybe? No, wait, what? We're here now? <laughs> I'm a little lost. I don't really want to take it. I don't need it. But what happened here? Hmm. I was kind of expecting to get some more, like, backstory already, but not, not yet. Very mysterious. There's just lots of fuel here, but we don't need it. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm still, you know, looking for secrets. <laughs> Mostly. There's so many. But since we can't stash them, it makes no sense to pick them up. We feel like a bad idea to drop down here. Let's do it. What is this? What? F. Oh, okay. That's neat. Okay, I mean, I'm assuming we can go, we can go back at some point. Ooh, we're loading though. <laughs> we might have just skipped a whole like floor, because that elevator could have taken us up higher. But I, I, like, how was I supposed to know? I guess I could have known that like dropping down there with no apparent way back up would be like a one-way trip. Man, those textures take forever <laughs> to pop in. It's wild. Oh, and we can't even leave anymore. Hmm. 
guess we have to live with our choices for now. For now. Maybe we come back out there and then there's... Maybe this is like a hub out there and then, I don't know. Can't doubt it though. We get more story. Someone died, I'm guessing. And Birdface walked through the night of the glow stick looking for something in the water. Or no, making plants grow. He seems surprised. He's thinking. Is that a good idea to just like drink that? I don't... I don't know. Where are we going now? This is like a plague thing. This is sort of supposed to be like a plague doctor mask thing and then... healing people with the new plant thing? I don't know. Doesn't even need the cane anymore. Wow. Okay. But then I guess things didn't really work out <laughs> in the end because when those people we found up there they weren't doing weren't doing very well. I'm guessing I'm not supposed to step on the glowing stuff, maybe? Maybe. Maybe I should try. Where are we now? What are we doing here? Why is everything the way it is? Oh, that healed me. Okay, so that's my health down there. Can we make another one grow? No, they are just grow ones. That would be too easy. <laughs> if, it, if it was just infinitely regrowing. Uh, we don't need it. Because that didn't take anything out of our glow stick. Okay. Yes. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to swim. Just a hunch. Don't want to lose some health right away again. Why would we do that? I mean, I'm for health, right? Hmm. I can't help but think about that top floor. <laughs> that we never got to. Because we went to the middle floor first. Anyway. What does that sound? Ah, for your waste, but let's take it. Okay, fishing. Very excited about fishing. Fell in the water. The kid fell in the water, okay. 
And that's like a, okay. Now he's fishing alone. And no more sunshine. Tragic story. I don't know why I'm doing this. These look so poisonous. <laughs> anyway. Hmm. Just take it. It's probably not really worth it, but I don't know. Maybe it is. What do I know? And there are more around, so we're probably fine. Again, it doesn't really seem like it would make sense for us to run out of... Oh, this looks like a door. Whatever that is, it's making spooky sounds. It's loud. I don't like it. <laughs> so it's so bright. Anyway, uh, what's in here? Okay, so I can I can go through the shallow water at least. Okay, I can actually no I I do take damage if I step on this. That's what it felt like would happen. Let's look at this maybe. I don't know. Well let's go in and do it whatever it is that we need to do here. No, I can't move that. <laughs> Man, that controls very weirdly. I don't like it. I was trying to spin the mouse to like, ro ro like rotate it, but it didn't. It did not did not no, did not really do that. I'm pretty sure that's what I need to do, though. Let me put this away and try again. I did it now. That's nice. Let's heal. Oh, this is like a forge. Okay. I get it. I do. Sure. Oh, that was just the, the print. I thought I could interact with this, but I can't. Okay. But I'm still not sure what I'm... Uh, it's very mysterious, yes. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm not sure where I'm going. I don't know what I'm trying to accomplish. Something there. Did I take damage from that little drop? Come on. Or was it just because I was near the plant it showed me my health? I'm not sure. Yeah, this is where he came from. Oh, I don't slide off. Oh, I hate when you slip in sliding games. <laughs> anyway. I guess that's okay. Hmm. Yeah. I just don't want to miss out on things and it feels like there is an ability, like I have the ability to miss out on things and I don't like that. kind of cool. I like it. I like it. 
But what am I doing over here now? Who knows? Okay, we can keep going this way, but... <laughs> we can't miss out on more things. So a few of them are broken. Fortunately, number two in a row, because that would make it a little bit more challenging, I guess. Let's climb up here. This is also kind of broken. Oh, very jittery. Why was this closed off? I wonder. Hmm. These shadows look weird. I mean, like, I'm, I'm sort of, I'm in. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. There aren't really that many puzzles yet. Or any, really. But I'm, I'm like, in. <laughs> Man, I hope this pays off, at least. Story-wise. In an interesting way. I like the way it looks. Everything's very orange. I like the setting. lighting all of these, but there must be a reason. Right. Right. It would be very unsatisfying if that just did nothing. <laughs> I mean, so far we've, we've got zero payoff for that, but, you know, that could change. Didn't even see that one before, before I got it there. But it's okay, there's one here. The thing is, like, if it does something, it feels like the game should be at a point now where maybe it's telling me at some point that, that it does something somehow. Like, I should maybe communicate that. Because, you know, you kind of have to look for them. They're not super obvious all the time. Do I have to jump on this? Oh, then I need to actually move it too. Right, we looked out that way. Yeah. Is there no lever on this side? <laughs> and how do I get back? Not another one way trip, no. Uh, I think we can fit the hour of that, so we should take it. Is there, not, is there no lamp out here? Guess not. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know, it's just, you know, it feels like you could just easily, easily skip some of this or miss some of them and then... I don't know, maybe it's just like an achievement thing, and you light all of them, or a certain number of them. 
And then I would still want to do it anyway. So it doesn't really matter for me, but I feel like from a game design kind of point of view, it would be interesting to know what it does if it, if it does anything. There was also somewhere to go on the other side there, right? Like down, we could have poured ourselves across some more. Hmm. Can't crouch jump through the window. Good to know. Okay. Okay, okay. Nothing. I should probably think about ending this episode, huh? Maybe not quite yet, but, but soon. Definitely soon. that fishing rod <laughs> but I cannot have it I cannot have it so we can go here or we can go this looks like a one-way trip again I hate it <laughs> unless we can go down somewhere in here too and then north back up again uh, almost four maybe we should wait a little Doesn't really tell us much. There's so much of the, the yellow stuff, <laughs> orange stuff, whatever. It's just too much of it. We don't even need nearly as much as we're getting here. But yeah, we could have skipped this entire room by just going down and then not being able to come back up. It's someone trying to find all these stupid little lamps to light that makes me nervous. Who knows how many I've missed already. Anyway. Almost looked like a ladder, it's a shelf door. I don't like this one. I don't know, but I didn't. Okay, the actual lever the actual lever part of the lever is missing. It's a problem. get it then where do I go from here can I jump out from this side I don't think I can or this would just be a trap door anyway I it would just I would just fall that doesn't seem good oh wait we can go here still right 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 Okay, 
on the lever, part of the lever. The handle, whatever you want to call it. Uh, okay. No more lamps. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't have a good feeling. Or a good sense of how easy it is to be the completionist here. Point out very though, that's <laughs> that seems to be true. Anyway. spot for a secret but I guess there aren't any <laughs> no little lamps no little lamps I was just gonna say it doesn't seem to make sense to pour that here, but yeah, we just took the handle part. That doesn't make some sense. Always a decent spot for our secret up here. I almost missed that. And that. Is that a spider? Almost looks like a spider. Anyway, are there more lamps? I don't think so. Where am I going? What am I doing? Don't know. that actually are there, are there any lamps I don't see one but I've missed them before so who knows come on <laughs> you can fit through that gap I want to end the episode, but I also kind of want to get to a point where, you know, we've accomplished something, we've learned something, where we feel like, oh, yeah, this is a natural point to end the episode within the progression of the game here, but... So far, it just keeps going. seen that before. Again, it doesn't really tell us much. Almost missed that. <laughs> I'm definitely missing some of these. There's no way I'm getting them more. They blend in too well. Oh wait, this is where we could have come across from from there? Before we went upstairs? Yes. Up the ladder, I guess, the stairs. And we could have done this whole thing backwards or something? But that doesn't really make sense. Or does it? Not really, no. I don't know, I'm confused about this.
Mm, it seems like progress though. This is where we started, right? This seems very scary, honestly. Right next to the waterfall here. Doesn't seem like a safe way to travel across here, but okay. Sure. Now, did we accomplish anything? And if so, what? Alright, I don't know, I don't know, but maybe maybe we'll get some answers next time. That's it for today, believe it or not. And I don't know, I have no, no idea what to expect. All I know is that I've probably missed some of these lamps, and I'm already sad because of that. But uh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> I'll see you. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.